<laughs> the best possible one in the world foul. I never thought skating SLS qualifier would not make me skate the whole season SLS because I didn't make the top three, but I still get in wild cards and be able to skate all the stops. For me, my favorite stop was Salt Lake City because there was a lot of Brazilian fans and they were bringing a lot of energy for me and skating my first SLS with the pro was, was like the best feeling. I was really hyped to be on the SLS, on my first SLS. I was, I was a, little, a little bit nervous, but at the same time, I, I did not expect that would be like by the top with the best skaters. Seeing my name on top seven got me so hyped, and at the same time, less nervous to skate the Super Crown. And it, it just got me more motivated to keep skating. What I like to do when I'm not skating is like hang out with my friends and watching movies, watching shows or playing games. I play on my phone. Me and my brother play pole on the phone. So we, we both stay for like hours playing with each other, like laughing. I, I miss him a lot, so it makes me happier to like talking to him. I learned this year at SLS that is, is more than just skating. It's about to meet new people, uh, talk to the fans, and seeing, seeing people like my age or older than me like asking for autograph, it, it just makes me remember like when I was just getting started and then watching Pirat or Luan. And when I first met him, it was just like, so hyped and I seen the, the, like those kids like really hyped to like see me and get an aut autograph is just like it just makes me happy. I'm super excited for the next SLS. Now I'm focusing on my part but after it gets done I'm gonna keep practicing and learn new tricks and maybe bring something new.